How to treat face eczema. Eczema is a condition which produces dry, reddened, itchy patches of skin. Fortunately, mild forms of eczema are relatively easy to treat. If you have a patch of eczema on your face, it can usually be treated through frequent application of a moisturizing lotion. If that doesn't work, you'll need to see a doctor. Ask if they can prescribe a medicated steroid cream that will clear up the rash. Or, if you prefer, there are various home remedies that you could use to alleviate the symptoms of eczema. Treating mild eczema. Diagnose the type of eczema. Eczema is a broad term which covers many different specific but related skin conditions. The physical symptoms of all types of eczema tend to be dry, reddened, itchy skin, which makes the diagnosis difficult. Some types of eczema are caused by allergies, immune disorders, or excessive washing of the facial skin. It's helpful to track your eczema symptoms and note what causes the eczema to break out. Try keeping a daily journal in which you record foods you've eaten, personal skincare routines, and any environmental factors that seem to have an effect on your eczema. Visit your doctor, and describe your eczema symptoms, including how long the rash has been present, and if any specific causes make the eczema worse. It's helpful to track your eczema symptoms and note what causes the eczema to break out. Try keeping a daily journal in which you record foods you've eaten, personal skincare routines, and any environmental factors that seem to have an effect on your eczema. Visit your doctor, and describe your eczema symptoms, including how long the rash has been present, and if any specific causes make the eczema worse. Avoid environmental factors that worsen your eczema. In many cases, eczema can be caused by external environmental factors. For example, seasonal allergies can trigger eczema, as can food allergies and extreme hot or cold temperatures. If you can pinpoint which of these factors may be triggering your eczema, try to avoid it as much as possible. Many of these environmental factors can only be determined through repeated experience. So, if you realize that your eczema flares up after you've eaten dairy products, cut them out of your diet. Many of these environmental factors can only be determined through repeated experience. So, if you realize that your eczema flares up after you've eaten dairy products, cut them out of your diet. Apply a moisturizing facial lotion to your face several times a day. You can apply a moisturizing facial lotion whether or not you've just taken a shower. If you're concerned that you'll forget the lotion, try setting a timer or writing down a lotion schedule on a notepad. Apply lotion as often as possible, perhaps on an hourly or even half-hourly schedule. If you're not sure which lotions are most effective, ask your doctor. Brands like Cetaphil, Eucerin, and Aveeno tend to work well. Look for lotions that contain petroleum jelly and mineral oil, and shy away from lotions with added fragrances. Take a lukewarm shower daily. Skin with eczema is very dry, and your primary goal in treating the eczema should be to moisturize your skin. Soaking your face in a lukewarm shower is a great way to begin the moisturizing process. Avoid taking multiple showers per day, as this may cause your skin to dry out further. If you find the lukewarm water uncomfortable, slightly raise the temperature. Do not use hot water, though, as it will dry out your skin. If you find the lukewarm water uncomfortable, slightly raise the temperature. Do not use hot water, though, as it will dry out your skin. Moisturize your face after taking a shower. Put on facial moisturizing lotion within 3 minutes after you get out of the shower. If you take a shower and don't moisturize immediately afterward, you'll risk drying out your skin and worsening the condition of your eczema. Use a mild facial soap when you bathe. The skin on your face is more sensitive and delicate than the skin on the rest of your body, and can be irritated more easily. If you have facial eczema, try switching to a milder soap than you've been using. Many soap brands make mild or protective lines of soap. Look for a soap that says, mild, on the label next time you're shopping for soap. Avoid soaps that include harsh, abrasive ingredients like triclosan, propylene glycol, sodium lauryl sulfate SLS, and most added fragrances. Avoid soaps that include harsh, abrasive ingredients like triclosan, propylene glycol, sodium lauryl sulfate SLS, and most added fragrances. Do not scratch the eczema. 
although it can sometimes be very itchy, you should never scratch your patches of eczema. Doing so can further irritate the already irritated skin, causing the eczema to worsen. Itching can also cause the eczema to break open and begin oozing liquid. Try putting on a moisturizing lotion if your eczema itches. Apply a hydrocortisone cream to the eczema. If your eczema is mild, you can most likely treat it with an over-the-counter 1% hydrocortisone cream. The cream can be purchased at any pharmacy or drug store. Apply a 1 half inch 1.3 cm sized dollop to the tip of a finger, and smear the cream around on your rash. Leave the cream on until it's completely absorbed. Mild eczema does not break open or ooze liquid. It's also contained in size, less than roughly 2 inches 5.1 centimeters.